My name is Leslie Smucker, and I'm a violinist and a composer. A lot of my performances are very theatrical, and they have a lot of objects that sort of come into contact with sound and manipulate sound. This piece is called Worlds Within, and it is inspired by a conch shell that they found in a prehistoric cave. And they realized that the conch shell was a, an instrument. And so when you put your ear up to the conch shell, you can hear the ocean. And so this was really the inspiration uh, for this piece. This concert is specifically made for people who are sensitive to sensory stimulus. This means that they might get overwhelmed by a loud sound. They would feel more comfortable if the lights are dim and all one lighting throughout the whole hall. It differs for every single person. My name is Zoe Reddy and I'm the Education and Outreach Coordinator for Rewire Music Festival. The program we're presenting today is a low sensory concert. Uh, for people that are sensitive to things like light and sound, the festival experience is often inaccessible. With a project like this, we are hoping to offer a positive social and cultural experience to this kind of audience. Many times people who are more sensitive to exterior world have a very vibrant interior world. And so I wanted that to be a part of the concert and part of the inspiration for making this. One way that this concert really stretched me as a musician was I had to think of drama and theater in a different way Rather than making something really loud and then really soft, I had to find other avenues of interest, um, drama. So this is the third time we're presenting a concert like this, but this year is different. This year we put out an open call and we received many submissions from all kinds of artists. And Leslie's work was selected because we felt that it was both visually and thematically, but also practically and musically, of course, uh, suitable and adventurous enough for this kind of an audience. It's been really great to work with Rewire through this whole process because they've given me the support and opportunities to talk with people from the community, about how I can create this project, especially for them. And I've learned so many things along the way, so it's been really eye-opening for me to learn about this process, learn how people experience concerts, and it really helps me to be informed through all of my music making, just a different perspective on listening. I would really encourage people who are thinking about creating music for sensory sensitive um, people to really do it and do research and really get into it because it's a really fulfilling experience. As a festival, we believe it's important to be not just a platform, but also a catalyst for developing this kind of a concert for a wide range of audiences.